like we never left the 2015 College World Series finals featuring a rematch of what we saw a season ago at this very park in Omaha, Nebraska. Hi again, everybody. Channing Poole with you. Welcome you to TD Ameritrade Park as the Virginia baseball team gets set to face off against the Vanderbilt Commodores, a team that took two out of three for the Wahoos a season ago to end last year's campaign in heartbreaking fashion. But for tonight, an opportunity and revenge as this best of three game series gets underway. It is a beautiful night for baseball in downtown Omaha as we get you set for first pitch. Next pitch, swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Dice will pick it up. Now walk over and tag Wiseman to complete Connor's first strike out of the night. And it's two up, two down to start the bottom half of the first inning. Connor Jones again comes set right. He spins, tosses the first. They got him leading and they got him picked off. So Reynolds running with the previous pitch. Jones times it perfectly. Fires over to Pavin Smith. This pitch is lined towards second. Caught by Clement, leaping up into the air. Snow cones it, then flips it back onto the diamond. Ernie Clement takes away a hit from Carl Ellison to keep the Commodores off the scoreboard here in the second. As the pitch chopped left side of the infield, diving is the third baseman, the flex to the shortstop, off balance throw to first, and he pulled the first baseman off the bag as Wheel had to jump up to handle it. That'll be the first hit of the night for the Wahoos, an infield single from Kevin Doherty. One-two pitch, swung on and missed, got him on strikes as Ellison way out in front. The one-two pitch, waved at and missed, got him on strikes. Jones back in the slider, diving down and away. Campbell can't lay off. Back-to-back -back strikeout. Now the payoff pitch. Swung on, tapped third base side. Charging his towns. Fields off balance throw to first. And Smith scoops it up, but just late. The next pitch. Way up high, ball four. Toffee swings, lines it towards left field. That ball is well struck, and it's over Doherty's handle and roll the wall. And Vanderbilt is on the scoreboard. Home from second is Wheel. Behind him is Reynolds. It's 2-0 Commodores as Will Toffee has struck for a two RBI double. To pitch hit back up the middle and through for a base hit past the diamond. Panero open it in center is Hazley. And home to score from second base is Carl Ellison. An RBI single from Roe Coleman. Extend the Vanderbilt lead. It is now 3-0 Commodores. Jones gets a final pad from Coach O'Connor, and he will depart after yet another outstanding effort here this evening. Outfield swung around the pole side against the right-hand hitter who lines it in a right center field for a base hit. Home from third is Swanson. It is 5-0 Vanderbilt. Now back at the wind up in the pitch. Swung on and lifted towards left center field. That'll chase Reynolds back. He turns his back, and that ball's over his head. One hops up into the seats for a ground rule double. Now the 2-2 pitch to Jaron Kendall. Swung on and lifted back up the middle. Clement into a dive, and he makes the catch. Full extension diving in the center field grass as Ernie Clement adds to his personal highlight reel. I mean, is this kid special or what? And the pitch. Swung on, hit back up the middle. There's a base hit into center field. They'll wave Towns around third. Kenny heads towards the plate, and Virginia is on the scoreboard. RBI single for Jack Gersten Meyer, and it's 5 to 1 Vanderbilt. The 0 1 pitch swung on and lifted towards center field. Starting back now, coming in is Brian Reynolds. He makes a two handed catch, and Vanderbilt has claimed game one of this College World Series finals by a 5 to 1 score, and the Hoos. We'll look to bounce back tomorrow and try to get it to a game three on Wednesday.